Welcome to our Dungeons & Dragons overview. In this short series, we will go over the past year of play. Our current campaign has been going on for well over a year, with its anniversary on January 13th. This campaign, titled The Tangled Web, takes place in our homebrew world of Isolde. This land is somewhere where all races, humans, dwarves, elves, even monstrous races like goblinoids, ogres, and orcs, live in a state of peace. And that is only possible because six generations ago, there was a war between the surface and the Underdark. It was led by a draw captain named Saber. And when he was taken down and his armies disassembled, both surface and Underdark found strong alliances with each other, forming bonds that would last the ages. The big threat of our campaign is the demigod Lilith, who even five centuries after her death, poses a threat on the peace that binds our world. She created eight cruel weapons, which Saber's army wielded. As Saber's army crumbled, the weapons died with their owners, scattered across the lands. These weapons of dread have an incredible curse put on them, turning their wielder evil and giving them monstrous strength. Their minds are enslaved as the Queen of Spiders imprints her will onto whoever wields these weapons. Our campaign is a monster hunting campaign, with our adventurers traveling the world, exploring civilizations, delving into their own backstories, while slaying some wicked creatures. The eight weapons of dread have re-emerged and found their way into positions of power once more. Instead of an army, the current wielders of her weapons are powered up individuals. We've already faced the likes of monstrous kobolds, gigantic black puddings, and empowered devils. All of them tearing up the land in their own unique ways. Let's see what else waits for us in the next adventure in Lilith's Tangled Web.